everyone hopes that something is going to happen. Kane is hardly disappointed throughout his career. He's been a wonderful, wonderful player for Bangladesh. In all three formats of the game. Yeah, just trying to get this, this field right. It's very accurate. Very, very accurate indeed. That um, pulsing red dot halfway down is the dismissal of Rian Ahmed. As I've said, he's bowled much better deliveries that haven't got wickets. One more delivery will finish the Shakib Al Hassan spell. He's got four for 35 to go along with his brilliant innings with bat in hand. Big shot for LBW. Long, hard look and given. Immediately, Jofra Archer says, Let's go upstairs. TV Ampere to director to have a review for LBW given out. I checked front foot, it's a fair delivery. Can I have front on spin vision? One more time, please. Nice and slow. Ball passing very close to the bat. Can I have Altais for confirmation? Keep rolling, keep rolling. Line, keep rolling. Satisfied. No bad involved. Ball tracking, please. When you're ready. Pitching in line, impact in line, wicket missing. Back to one field, Ruchi. I recommend to change your decision. Your so it won't be five for Shakib Al Hassan, but what a spell of bowling it was for him. Four for 35 in his 10 overs. It's 43 gone, 196 for nine. What a spell from Shakib Al Hassan. What a game he's had. 75 with the bat. And uh, he's picked up 4 for 35 of 10 overs that he has bowled. And raised hope for Bangladesh to pull one back against the world champions. He has been a champion himself. He could have been a fifer. Was given in his favor. Review taken. That was going to miss the stumps. Wonderful, wonderful uh, display of all-round performance uh, from uh, Shakib Al Hassan. Chris Wokes unbeaten on 34. He's still at 51 and 42. Most of his. straight back to him and he's taking it on the second attempt they finally picks up the wicket and it's all over Mustafa Zaraman managed to pick up the wicket of Chris Spokes to wrap England up for 196 England gets bowled out for 196 in the 44th over and Bangladesh won by a handsome margin of 50 runs. It's a good way of finishing it off. A little bit of a juggle from Mr. Fazor, but he didn't panic. And on his second attempt, took the catch. A good performance from 
Bangladesh, remember series gone, but they finish it off in style, a good win. They win by 50 runs and a good way to go into the three international T20 series that comes up in a couple of days here in Chattagram. Disappointment for Wokes, he has to go for 34. Joffre Archer ends with five not out. And the two teams will get together and shake hands and get ready in a couple of days to start that T20. Tammy McBell, remember, won the toss and decided to have a bat first. So I got to 246 all out. And we wonder whether that was going to be enough. Well, it was. Regular wickets. Shakib was excellent. And there's four for 35. We'll go with his 75. A good performance from the all rounder today. Yeah, it's been excellent uh, from Bangladesh right from the word go. I thought they were in the game on the very first one day international. Uh, and they took on England, the world champions at Mirpur, Dhaka. It slipped away from them. And in the second, it was all England. The wrap of the series in the second, yeah, but this is a good comeback. It's a very strong statement from uh, a side which has been very, very good, especially at home in this format of the game. Finally, pulling one back. Uh, they'll be mighty pleased. Alan Donald will be very happy and pleased to see what the seamers have done. Nandika Hathora Singer, the new head coach. Win in the bag. It's all smiles. And they have to work hard. But thanks to that wonderful, wonderful display of power run performance from Shakib al -Hassan. They restricted England for 196. Yes, there was a start for Phil Salt and uh, James Swins. But nobody going on to play a bigger role with the bad 20s and 30s. Chris Wokes in the end, the last batter to get out. The partnership, you know, they started well. I re remember that opening partnership of 54 or 50. Then they lost those three quick wickets early on. 49 between Curran and Wins, raised hope, but nothing much from the rest. Defending 247. Took wickets early on. Taizul ended up with two for 52. Two for 38 for Ibadot. He was impressive today with his nine overs and a maiden. Once again, an experience of Shakib Halasan. Four for 35. And Bangladesh bowlers as a collective bowled really well.